Good afternoon. Is there anybody who has never seen comics? I hope no. Here you can see examples of them. Do you recognize it? I think you have seen all these pictures. At least once. Some people say that it's childish. Others think that comics are too boring. Sometimes they are, but when it's time for serious projects, this childish hobby unites different people and starts their teamwork. I'm talking about comics art, so what does the word art mean for you? Close your eyes and think for a bit. You can now open your eyes. Maybe it's that picture of a mysterious woman hanging on the wall in the museum. Or maybe some ancient statues. But art can also mean something different. What exactly? Well, I will tell you later. I've attended various art clubs since I was five. Recently, I visited a comic book club. A few months ago, I began to attend this drawing course. I didn't even know my clubmates for a couple of sessions and everything started from my mom's phrase. Do you want to create a comic book? I was sitting in our car before the first session and thinking, oh, that will be scary. But that wasn't. Our teacher presented information to us. <clears throat> she helped a lot and tried to cheer us up. This was already the second year of this club, but our group was only half new. Everyone chose their own topics and started to think and draw on the, <coughs> on the unique plot of our future comics. I didn't have many ideas and my comic book was inspired by one game. But some of the girls already had chapter one, uh, chapter one from the previous course and too many ideas for the second. For 20 minutes everyone was silent. I was silent too until our teacher came to me and asked what my comic book will be about. We started to discuss our ideas and that was the beginning of our friendship. First four sessions we were working with our teacher's tips and, <coughs> and then we started to draw. And even if I missed three sessions of eight and was a bit behind them, guys there were still friendly to me. Every session somebody forgot his or her pencil case, was sleepy and even hungry, so our teacher could give us her chocolate bar to continue our energetic work. My group was friendly. We helped each other with pencils, erasers, rulers, nearly everything we were looking for. At the last lesson, everyone was panicking. I finished my draft a day before the sixth session and completed the comic book at the last one. At the last lesson, we had 30 minutes to draw and then 60 minutes to drink tea and say see you to each other. While the girls were fighting for the third package of sweets, I was drinking tea. I took two cookies with me and finished my comics journey. Our relationship developed and we became really good friends, even if we didn't want to speak to each other at the first sessions. We were united with art. Our drawings will be printed this month, so we did a great job. If you want to meet new faces, somebody who thinks just like you, join a club that you like, start the art of friendship. And after all, I can say what is art for me. For me, it is something that unites me with other people, helps me to feel more confident when I meet new faces. But for every person in this very room or anywhere on earth, art can mean something completely different maybe even more important. Art can be a hobby, lovely work, many things. Find your own art.